Hello, Fregard. I'm Jarek. Thank goodness, you arrived. The Shefton told me that you saw some sort of disturbance outside your hut. Yes, my husband thinks I'm going a bit mad, but I know what I saw. Red eyes piercing with a terrifying stare. I was so frightened, I fell to the floor. It was the middle of the night, so I couldn't make out what it was. But when I got back on my feet, it wasn't there anymore. I see. I have a look around and see what I can find. Thanks for your help. Of course. Uh, the sandpit looks... Oh, it's a baby basilisk, okay. Okay, so this is nothing dangerous. Well, to me at least, but these guys don't have too much armor. Nor a mirror shield, as far as I can see. But I can honestly say I wasn't expecting that, but that's true. Looks like it dropped a letter of some sorts. Let's see. For years we have waited and at last our time to rise has come. Soon we will bring terror to the Fremony province. Go forth, brothers and sisters. Go forth and wreak havoc amongst their people. Once they are distracted, we will tear down the boards that hold our king. We will finally free the German gun. The time is ours. They will be unprepared. Their ban on magic shall be their downfall. They have no champion to defend them this time. No V. What in the hell? Have you looked around the hut yet, Jarek? The thing that made the noise outside your home is, is gone now. I keep looking to see if I can find anything else. Thanks again for your help. Make sure to bring anything you find back. I make sure my husband delivers it to the Shefton. Okay, I'm gonna have to show this letter to the Shefton because this is not something... ...unworrying. Nah, let's go here. It's a copier that I could have taken that. No, it's fine. Actually, what happens if I do take it? Do the drunks get mad? Hey Jarek, go buy your own beer! That cake belongs to me! Okay, I expected as such. Okay, I have my own, don't worry. Phew. How goes the investigation, Jarek? I'm still looking into it at the moment. No rush. Mm, okay. So I was looking at this lock slide and I found a broken fang. It's shipping with venom it seems. I'd better make sure I don't pick my fingers. Isn't this like... Nah, this is not Zora's fang, it's, it's not the right color. Plus how the hell would it get here? A venom gland? This doesn't look safe. Good job my, back, my backpack magically stops me from picking. <laughs> yeah. I think I found something, well, everything I need for this investigation. I should have Freygir now now. Alright, what do you have to say about this? Have you looked around the hearts yet, Jarek? I've had a look around and found a few things I'd like to show the Shefton. The thing that made the noise outside your home is gone now, so there's nothing to worry about, as I said. Thank goodness, I have my house husband take those items to the Shefton for you. Yeah, yeah, alright. Thank you so much for your help, Jarek. No problem. I best be getting back to the Shefton. Oh, seems we have a fellow adventurer here, okay. Uh, Alright, uh, Shefton. Jarek, I'm glad you returned. This letter you have found is very worrying and requires our most attention. I don't understand. What does the letter mean? Who is the German gun? And since when could basilisks read and write? While they may not to show it, basilisks are much smarter than they seem. Many years ago, a grey basilisk army enslaved our people and took our home. Damn. The German gun, sometimes known as the Serpent King. Oh, so that's where the fan comes from. Was the leader of this army. Along with his hooray generals, Cypher, Vritra, and Bakuna, he brought a terror to these lands unlike any other. 
If it hadn't been for the bravery of a great hero, we might never have been freed. A hero? Yes, he was known as V. So that's who the letter mentioned. He stood up to the Serpent King and confronted him on the Islands of Storm. It is said that the two of them fought for days, but in the end, V stood victorious. What happened next? Well, that depends on who you ask. The birds wrote the greatest song about V's victory. They called it the Ballad of the Basilisk and they claim V killed the German gun. But... Well, birds are known to bend the truth a bit, especially if it makes the song sound better. In reality, V sealed the Serpent King in a magical prison on the island, where he remains to this day. A magical prison? I thought the Fremony people didn't approve of magic. V was different. Stories tell of how he unlocked the potential of magic with a single touch of a stone. In that moment he became more than just a man. A god? It's not a distinction the Fremony particularly care for. To us, he was always been a hero to be respected, not a god to be worshipped. They say he felt the same way. But he earned the right to use magic. Exactly. Now the Moon Clan, on the other hand, did not earn that right. Their use of magic is an insult to our people. So what can we do about the German gun? We will stay strong, Jarek. We'll... We'll be doomed! Our arm isn't large enough to hold back the force of the Serpent King. I can help. Jorak, you're strong, but you're no army. You're forgetting Brand. We have the element of surprise. They don't, they don't know that we are aware, we're aware of their attack. We could have days to prepare before they make their move. We could... Chef and Brand. Hello, Agnar. Agnor, what is it? Chef de Brandt, I'm here to on behalf of the Reverend Council. We've heard some disturbing news about the Basilisk in the town. Well, I won't deny there's been a little issue, but Jarek and I will soon have things back under control. Jarek, when will you see that this outlander is the cause of all our problems? Jarek is no outlander. He passed our trials and is a Fremenic, just like you and I. You can discuss it all you want, but he is an outlander and always will be. Ever since we let him in, we have nothing but trouble. And to top it all off, now we have Basilisk wandering our town. The council have had enough. What are you saying, Agnor? I have a declaration here signed by seven of our twelve council members. We declare this outlander an exile. This is outrageous. Jarek is one of us. Do not use that name. The decision of the council is final. As Shefton, you are honored bound to enact it. I see. Exile, you must, uh, you must leave a province. Our people will no longer see you as their brother. Shefton, Brandt, Jester is haste over the southeast. Leave at once. Do not attempt to interact with myself or my people. Oh man. Oh man. Well, that's not what we needed in these times. 